I hope you've all been enjoying the show. Ladies, listen up. Fitnix, fitness expert Madeline Mosier has us covered with a leg workout designed specifically for women. Kristen got all the details. I'm joined by women's fitness coach Madeline Mosier. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> hey, thanks for coming out here today. Yeah. I'm super excited about this topic, especially because your legs are probably one of the biggest muscles in your body. So you're focusing today specifically on leg workouts for women, correct? Yeah. And I, I I see we're already super excited. We've already got some <laughs> movements going here. Just walk us through this. Sure, so I've got several movements to take you guys through. You can pepper them into your workouts. You can do these at home. Uh, all you need are a couple kettlebells. Always recommend starting light and going heavy. My first movement that Mallory is doing here is a reverse weighted lunge. Um, and she's doing it from a deficit. So you notice that she's stepping up to the plates and then stepping back. This what? is very challenging for our core, for our, our glutes our quads, lots happening here. She's not using lightweight, you guys. So this is heavy and she's doing it beautifully. What's the main muscle that she's working with this movement? So we've got quads, we've got glutes going on here and even core stability is at play. Oh wow, so it's an all around yeah. move. Okay, and then moving down here, these, I see she kind of kind of bending over a little bit. Yep, so these ladies are doing what's called a Romanian deadlift. They have a soft bend in their knee and they're pushing their butt back towards the wall behind them. So glutes, hamstrings, really working hard in this movement. Also core stability. Uh, so one thing I like to always cue my clients on and my, my athletes is as you're deadlifting, press your feet down into the ground. Good because tip. a deadlift is two motions happening. Not only are we pulling the weight, but we're also pushing our body weight into the ground and this helps to turn on, turn on our glutes back here. And this is our main mover. And then I see we also have another movement going on over here. Oh yeah, so Mallory's doing a weighted bridge. Uh, so this is all about glutes and hamstrings. So as she raises her glutes up, there's a big activation happening back here. Her hamstrings are working and that added weight, she's got a 30 pound dumbbell. That's not light, so she's working hard. These two athletes, we got Tony and Aaron, they're doing some sumo squats. So this is a wide stance sumo, and this helps us to get into those inner thighs, as well as our glutes, our hamstrings, our quads. So a lot happening with this movement as well. Their core is turned on, they're moving strong, they're moving well, they're breathing through the movement, which I always have to remind my athletes, don't hold your breath, keep breathing. Uh, and you'll notice Aaron here, she's got that engagement, ex exhaling and bringing in that engagement, hugging the baby as she stands. Uh, I always recommend starting with about three sets. Try and hit eight reps at, at a light weight when you're beginning out or when you're beginning your, your exercise. And then every week you add a little bit more weight and challenge yourself and start from there. That's great advice, definitely yeah. helpful for the viewers at home. Yeah. So Mallory's working her calves in this one. So she's doing a three-way calf raise. So she's got her toes pointed forward here and she's got the weight in her hands. And then she's gonna transition her feet a little bit and she's gonna go into a pigeon toed stance. So this way we can start to uh, target all sides of the calf muscles. Um, and then lastly, she's gonna turn, around, turn out, heels together, and then she's getting that full range of motion. And notice she's not doing quick little bounces. She's taking her time with the movement really slow and controlled. What would your best advice even be to people who are trying to get back into fitness that maybe have let it go for a little bit? Start light. I mean, even starting with a few walks a day or a few walks a week, that's a great place to begin. Just get your body moving again. Start uh, adding in some mobi mobility and start with light weight because you can always go up from there. And then lastly, I think we should work on maybe my stance, even just working yeah. on, on, <laughs> on how to get me set up to do something like this. And as we're doing that, can you just let people know how they can find more information and how they can check you out? Sure, so you can always find me on uh, Instagram at Madeline Mosier. Uh, you can also look at my website, MadelineTimFitness.com. Madeline, this is awesome. Yeah. I really appreciate it. I think so pull those yeah, yeah, back. Yeah. spent a little time on this. Thanks, Madeline. We appreciate yeah. you. Thanks, ladies. Thank you guys. <laughs>